Hey guys, what's up? So, I haven't done a scripting video in a while, so I thought I would just do a quick little... I want to make a little typewriting uh, text, I guess, kind of. Now, this can be used in all sorts of things, like... Um, mainly, I use it for dialogue in my games. Like, when, a, say, you come up to a character, say you come up to this dummy, and he talks to you, and it's just a little dialogue that, like, typewrites. <coughs> That's mainly what I use it for. Um, so I'll show you how to do it real quick. It's not that hard. Um, I'll just rename this to, I don't know, dialogue. Dil I Og. Okay. Uh, let's do dialogue test. And we'll just insert a text label. <laughs> and really quick, I'm gonna make this uh like that. <clears throat> and I'm 8.2. <clears throat> Alright, so we got this text label, and I'm actually gonna make it like always. I like my cartoon and text scaled and I always just make the text size one just because so how do we turn this into text um, well, first let's get rid of this stupid label so we don't need this label um, let's actually make this order a little bit thicker it's a little bit nicer looking <coughs> so To um, get the typewriter effect that you're looking for, uh, first we need a local script. <laughs> so, um, actually, I'm gonna go to audio, and I'm gonna I'm gonna make this a little bit more interesting. Just get a little tick sound effect. Is this one? Yep, this works. Alright, so I'm just going to put that in there just so I have this ID. Actually, I'm going to just copy this ID. There we go. <laughs> so I don't know if I want to while wait or if I just want... Eh. Nah, I'll just, I'll just do text. Okay, so local text equals... I don't know, just Hey, I'm trying to type here. So there's the text we're going to be using. So it's pretty simple. All we're going to do is for that text, we're just going to make <coughs> a for loop. So we have the text. Now I'm just going to do for i equal equals one. To hashtag text do so now this is just a loop and it's just gonna loop through the number of uh, number of letters and number of characters I guess in this string so it's just gonna loop through the amount of characters in that string <clears throat> and 
And in doing so, we're actually going to do script.parent.text equals string.sub. And in here, we're going to get the string. So we're going to get text. And then we're going to have it start at 1. And then we're going to have it end at i. So basically what that is doing, well, and then we're going to add a wait. <clears throat> so basically what this is doing is, is looping through the amount of characters in here. And while doing so, it'll start at like 1. And then it'll um, make it go to whatever I is. So since I starts at one, it'll just start with A, and then it'll go with AR, and then ARE, then ARE space, <coughs> then ARE space Y, and then so on. You get the point until it's done. <coughs> It's kind of a bad explanation, but it's kind of the easiest way I can explain it. So, if I actually run this now, um, it should just... No? Okay, I don't need to run. Do I actually need to play? Do I actually need to play a game? Yeah, I need to actually play. So there we go. So that's kind of basically it. Um, now, if you want it to be a little bit better <laughs> you can tell I have this little tick here so we can right after we get this down what we're gonna do is do local core equals quarantine quarantine dot wrap function <laughs> and before I forget we're just gonna do just gonna put core down there um, so basically what this is, is it'll fire whatever function is inside the quarantine, but it won't wait. Like, it's, it's kind of, mm, I don't know how to explain it. Like, I'm really bad at explaining, <laughs> sorry about that, but <laughs> basically it won't, um, you can have any like function you want uh, run here and it won't wait for this function to be done to start running more functions if that makes sense it'll kinda just run at the same time I don't know how else to explain that in any simpler form but uh, it's really useful that's all I can say so basically in this quarantine, we're going to make a local sound equals instance.new sound. Oh, okay. And then sound dot sound I <clears throat> D equals. And I copied that from earlier. So we can actually go ahead and delete this now. Or cut it. Same difference, even though cutting actually copies it, but whatever. <coughs> Sound dot parent equals script dot parent dot parent. So we're just putting it in. We're just putting it in the screen UI. Um, Sound colon play. And the reason we have this quarantine is because we're just gonna wait for it to end. And if we didn't have this uh, wrap function here, then it would wait for the sound to end, and then it would play, pay, uh, and then it would, I guess, put the next letter. If that makes sense. Uh, so basically. <laughs> We are creating a sound, making the sound ID what we want it, parenting it to the screen GUI, playing it 
then we're gonna wait for it to end and then we're just going to destroy it <clears throat> So that's basically it and you can go uh, more in depth here if you want like you can do like sound dot volume equals like one or equals 0 0.2 if you want it quieter <coughs> but we'll just do 0.5 we'll just leave this stuff at the default uh, what else can we add let me just add this sound back really quick. <clears throat> max distance. Well, we don't need the max distance since it is just in a screen GUI. Yeah, all we need, all we would need is the volume since it's just in a screen GUI. Okay. And yeah, I'm just gonna leave the volume at 0.5 anyway. So. Yeah, this should be good. Now, if we click play, you should hear ticks every time it uh, plays. Oh, I don't know how good the tick sound will be. That was loud. It was very loud. Let me turn that down a bit. Try point two, and I almost put my headset on just in case there was no way. <laughs> and there you go. That's pretty much it. Oh, not uh, not what I meant to do. And also, if you wanted to make it slower, you could add a weight here. I don't know why you'd want it to be slower, but. If you wanted, you could make it uh, pretty much as fast as you wanted. <clears throat> but this is real slow, so I think we're just going to keep it at the normal weight. But yeah, if you enjoyed, <laughs> leave a like, and don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.